Miraculous Bible Verses for a Financial Breakthrough In this moment, make your present set known to the Lord and ask Him to grant you the desire to pray and enter into this time of prayer. Matthew 6 verse 33 But seek first His kingdom and His righteousness, and all the things will be given to you as well. Thank you, Lord, that because I am seeking you and your kingdom first, all these things shall be added unto me. Philippians 4 verse 19 Thank you, God, for meeting all needs according to the riches of your glory in my Saviour, Christ Jesus. Deuteronomy 8 verse 18 But remember the Lord your God, for it is He who gives you the ablatito produce wealth, and so confirms His covenant, which He swore to your ancestors, as it is today. Riches or no riches, Lord, I will always. Remember you all your power and glory comes from you alone. Thank you for blessing me. Just as was done for my ancestors long ago, all my hope is in you. Proverbs 10 verse 22 The blessing of the Lord brings wealth, without painful toil for it. You are such a great God everything. You do it with ease and grace. Thank you for bringing wealth into life without the painful struggle that could come with it. John 10 verse 10 The thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I have come, that they may have life, and have it to the full. Thank you for blessing me to the full. Lord, I put all my trust in you. I shall not fear, nor shall I want. Proverbs 20 to verse 4 Humility is the fear of the Lord, and its wages are riches and honour and life. Help me to be and remain humble, Lord, with my humility. Will come riches, honour and long life. Praise Jesus. Deuteronomy 29 verse 9 Carefully follow the terms of this covenant, so that you may prosper in everything you do. Help me to follow your commands, wishes and divine will, Lord, so that I may prosper in all that I do. Luke 6 verse 38 Give, all it will be given to you, a good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over, will be poured into your lap dot, for with the measure you use, it will be measured to you. You are such a just and righteousness. And fair God, thank you for being me incredible Father in heaven where is quick to bless and slow to. Anger I shall give to others with all my heart and soul. I will do anything you ask of me all the days of my life. I trust you. Deuteronomy 28 verse 6 You will be blessed when you come in and be blessed when you go out. Thank you, Lord for blessing me when I come and when I go. Thank you mightily for blessing me always. Proverbs 3 verse 8 to 10 Honour the Lord with your wealth, with the first fruits of all your crops, then your barns will be filled to overflowing, and your vats will brim over with new wine. Help me to honour you, Lord, with all my wealth and all the first fruits of my crop. Thank you for causing my life to be filled with overflow. 1 John 5 verse 14 to 15 This is the confidence we have in approaching God that if we ask anything according to His divine will He hears us and if we know that He hears us whatever we ask we know that we have what we asked of Him Lord, as I approach your throne of grace today I pray that You would align all my prayers and supplications according to Your divine will Thank You for hearing me and for granting my heart desires. Deuteronomy 28 verse 11 to 12 The Lord will grant you abundance, prosperity in the fruit of your womb, the young womb, the young of your livestock and the crops of your ground in the land he swore to your ancestors to give you. The Lord will open heavens, the storehouse of his bounty, to send rain on your land in season and to bless all the work of your hands you will lend to many nations and will borrow from none. Thank you, Lord, for causing me to lend and not to borrow. Thank you for blessing me with abundant prosperity. Thank you for opening the heavens of abundance and for blessing the work of my hands. Amen. Proverbs 22-9 The generous will themselves be blessed, 
for they share their food with the poor. Lord, strengthen my heart of mercy, and sharpen my virtue of charity. I will be generous to the poor and trust you for the returned. Blessings, anything you give I am eternally grateful. Job 20 to verse 21. Submit to God and be at peace with Him. In this way prosperity will come to you. Help me to fully submit to your will. Lord help my soul to be at peace with all you do and desire for me. I expectantly await the prosperity that shall soon spring forth. Matthew 6 verse 26 Look at the birds of the air, they do not show or reap, or store away in barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not much more valuable than they? Father God, help me remember me value and my worth. Help me to keep my eyes fixed on you and trust you for our provision. Malachi 3 verse 11 to 12 Bring the whole tithe into Thesta house, that there may be food in my house. Test me in this, sis the Lord Almighty, and see if I will. Not throw open the floodgates of heaven, and pour out so much blessing that there will not be room enough to store it. I will prevent pests from devouring your crops and the vines in your fields will not drop their fruit before it is ripe, says the Lord Almighty. Then all the nations will call you blessed. For yours will be a delightful end, says the Lord Almighty. Help me to trust you more with my finances, Lord help me, to accept the challenge of tithing you desire, so thought he may experience your abundant blessings from heaven. All the nations shall call me blessed because of you. To Corinthians 9 verse 10 to 11. Now he who supplies seed to thee sower and bread for food will also supply and increase a store of seed and will enlarge the harvest of your righteousness. You will be enriched in every way so that you can be generous. In every way so that you can be generous on every occasion. And your generosity will result in thanksgiving to God. Thank you, God for supplying me every need and enlarging my harvest. I am enriched in every way possible, and I am fully able to be generous. On every occasion, thanks be to God. Luke 12 verse 29 to 31 And do not set your heart on what you will eat or drink. Do not worry about it, for the pagan world runs after all such things, and your Father knows that you need them, but seek his kingdom and these things will be given to you as well. I will not worry about that which is out of my control, Lord. I know you are fully in control of all the things, you know what I need, and you are faithful to deliver them. I will see instead your kingdom, and all these things will be given to me besides. Amen. Psalm 24 verse 1 The earth is the Lord's, and everything in it, the world, and all who live in it. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, like and share.